Hey guys, it's Travis. Um, today I'm going to be working with my girlfriend to make a bird bath holder for this pole outside of the front of the yard. Um, we have a bird feeder that sits on top of it and it would be cool if we could have a bird bath to work with it. This is what we're actually trying to hang. This thing hangs from the pole and then the bird bath sits inside of it. I don't really know where I'm starting with this, but I bought some exhaust clamps that I'm hopefully gonna clamp onto the pole, drill some holes into it, put a flagpole into it, drill a hole into the wood that goes into the flagpole holder, uh, cut that short so that it hangs just from the pole. We don't wanna create too much of a scene and create issues with the fucking blend wood. That's the plan for now. I'm gonna basically just buy like a saw, uh, some bolts, and a flagpole holder. I think it'll look cool. So let's see how it goes. It's pretty fucking hot, so I'm hoping, hoping that I can get this done within a couple of hours. So this is the bird feed that I was talking about. Here it is, covered in bird shit. So I think first I need to get the diameter of the pole, a rough estimate, because I'm gonna be using clamps anyways. And I'm gonna try to figure out how high I want this to hang off the ground. So we'll use the tape measure. So it's 69 inches tall. Try not nice. to stand directly in front of this. Oh. 69. Ideally, I want it to be pretty low to the ground so that the squirrels and the black cat that I've made friends with today can still drink from it. Is it possible to make it like not high at all? Like six inches off? That right. would be best. Yeah, I think so. So now we're going to Home Depot to go and get the stuff we think we need. We had to take her car because my car does not have air conditioning. And also I assumed that so that you can record while... Were you planning to record and drive at the same time? No. No. I wasn't going to record this. This is the plan to get in there. I couldn't find a camera strap. So we're rigging up her bag with what we need. So All the mics and stuff are in there. Hopefully nobody tells us to stop. Now that I'm in here, I do feel like I should have more carefully planned. I have a list. I'm going to call it now and say that it was wishful thinking that you're going to be done with this tonight. I'm going to finish it today. This is kind of what I'm looking for. Just a pole. And then the flagpole mount. But these are too flimsy, I think. Metal. This is the set, too. Do you just have them out? Okay. This looks more like what we need. Right, this metal pole to hang the arm while you're not using all your poles. Mm -hmm. So what you're gonna do, you know, what you can do is you can cut it down to the length you need. Mm -hmm. Obviously, the further out you go, the less weight it can hold. Right, right. the less weight it's gonna hold, and you can throw, you can fill it <laughs> if you need to. What would I fill it with? You can, if you can cap the end, you can fill it with sand. That's a good even, idea. You can even melt wax on the end just to make it solid. Mm -hmm. um, just anything ideal, so that it doesn't it right. doesn't buckle. Right. Right. I think that's a good idea. So we have this bracket here. This is supposed to work. I hope I'm going to cut one of these in half. I get three tries because I get three poles. I'm going to fill it up with either caulk or sand or something. I'm going to bolt these poles to the exhaust bracket and hopefully that will accomplish what we're looking for. I have a question. What? What do we do with the flag? We desecrate it. <laughs> <laughs> we will not be displaying the flagpole. Well, the flag from the flagpole. The actual flag might make its way into my house. Even, look at it, I look like I'm in ISIS too. I do not get how people vlog like this all the time. My arm is tired, this lens is cool but it's metal and it's heavy. And now I need to get a saw and my other hand is already full. So we're gonna use this other person to carry it all for us. Oh, is that me? That's you. Have you used one of these before? A sawzall? Yes. Okay. I just wanted to know like, what's the chance of us losing a finger in this project? It's getting real dangerous here. Now we just need something to tighten it with because my drill is not going to work for that and I prefer to use it. These will do the trick. There we go. See, now this is not for me. I will not be paying for this. 
any mistakes made are the fault of the person buying them. You, you acknowledge that by scanning this. Who also cannot use a pricing gun. <laughs> for a grand total of $107 for something that we probably should have just bought for our $50. It's for the birds. <laughs> Anyways, on to the important stuff. I got my fucking Sawzall, which I'm looking forward to use because who doesn't enjoy using a Sawzall? Um, I've got my flag poles and my flag. This won't be going up outside. But here's uh, the poles I'm gonna use to mount the bird bath from. Um, I'm probably gonna cut it in about half and then drill a hole into it so that this hook this hook is gonna lock into that hole, hopefully. Um, I'm gonna fasten it to the pole using exhaust clamps. Um, I'm probably gonna have to drill some extra holes right here because it doesn't exactly perfectly line up. I would prefer even to cut some off of the edge here. I'm gonna drill some holes on the side of these other two holes where the U goes in like this so this will sit on top of two clamps and then the flagpole will sit mounted in here then this hook will hang down something like this just far enough away from the pole where the clamp is then the actual bird bath sits inside of this dish here so hopefully I just nail it the first time and nobody ever has to touch it because I'm ready to go and I will see you at the flagpole. Alright, so it is just about 8 o'clock and I just finished up the bird bath mounting thing that you saw outside. If you liked it, stick around, maybe I'll find something else to do with this. But uh, other than that, it was fun. The next video is probably just going to be some recordings of birds in the front yard so I have a reason to test out on my lenses. See you later.